find the general solution of the differential equation. So we got du over dt equals 2 plus t4 over u cube t squared plus u4 t squared. So u is dependent variable while t being on the bottom is an independent variable. So we try to separate these variables u and t. So let's try to simplify. Let's simplify the right hand side. So here this is just du over dt. Uh, we have nothing on the top, just leave that. On the bottom, we can factor something out. Basically, we want to factor, we want to separate u and t. So just factor u so that we can bring. Or let's look at here, u3, u cube, u fourth, t squared, t squared. Okay, let, let's factor t squared. Uh, we can factor more, but we want to separate the variables. So, just factor t squared and see what happens. Then we get u cubed plus u to the fourth. Okay, so 2 plus t4 and t squared, that's function of t. And u cubed plus u4, that's function of u. And this is in time, so it looks like we can separate the variables. So when we write this in differential form, we can simply move dt to the other side. So we can rewrite this equation same as the following. So simply moving dt to the other side. Now I want to move this factor to the left side because this is a function of u and we got du here. So this is on the bottom. So basically we are multiplying both sides by this. So this is on the bottom. When we bring to the left, it comes to the top. Or you can think like, okay, multiply both sides by this factor. So that this one cancels in the right hand side and this one times du in the left side. So we have u cube plus u to the fourth du in the left side, uh, right hand side 2 plus t4 all over t squared dt. Okay, we cannot cancel here. This is plus. So this way we separated the variables. Function of u and du in the left, function of t and dt in the right side. Now uh, we need to integrate both sides. The left hand side is clear because we know u cube is like ax cube. So just use the power rule. Just use the power rule. But in the right hand side, uh, we got a fraction. But since we have two terms on the top, we can separate into two fractions. That way we can get rid of this fraction and we can integrate. Okay, so let's do that. So let's move. So here, in the right hand side, let, let me simplify this, okay, 2 plus t4 all over t square is in fact 2 over t square plus t4 over t square. And this is, we can move this up, so 2 t raised to negative 2, 2 copies cancel just t square. So I'm going to simplify this as this so that I can integrate 2t raised to negative 2 plus t square that dt. In the left side we got u cube plus u to the fourth du. Now integrate both sides then we get antiderivative of left side which we can finish using a power rule. Here, again, we can use the power rule. So we got 2t to the negative 2 t squared dt. So when we integrate, that's u4 four over 4 plus u5 five over 5 plus c, but we just write 1c on the other side, or we could have written plus c here as well. Here, 2t 
negative 2 plus 1 negative 1 over negative 1 plus t 3 over 3 plus c uh, we may live here but let's not leave negative exponents so u4 over 4 plus u5 over 5 equals this negative on the bottom bring to the front so negative 2 and t raised to negative 1 is just times 1 over t or we can write negative 2 over t it's the same thing so negative 2 over t this t to the negative 1 means t on the bottom and negative 2 on the front plus t cube over 3 plus c uh, u is the dependent variable here but we cannot solve for u it's complicated because u fourth u fifth so we may leave this as it is uh, and here the solution is given implicitly final